Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm super excited to share with you my favorite prompts for ChatGPT I've been using as a product manager. If you liked my last video, I wanted to dedicate this video towards a more comprehensive guide. I will deep dive into the following sections. By the way, I've collected all these prompts in a dedicated Notion database. You can grab a free copy down in the description box below. Let's get started. So in order to be super practical about using ChatGPT, we use a hypothetical example. We are being hired as a product manager for an early stage startup, Uber for meditation. Let's dive into the first section using that example. So I've been already feeding ChatGPT with the relevant context. And the first prompt is, we want to assume that ChatGPT is a venture capital fund in the health tech industry. And we wanted to look where is the most room for disruption. Next, in order to understand all the moving parts of the business, we want ChatGPT to create a simple business model canvas. And this is the prompt I've been using. Finally, in order to already gain a bit more understanding on users, I wanted to understand what are the best ways to conduct primary market research for our users' needs and preferences. Next, product vision, strategy, and road mapping. So now that we understand the market, create a strong vision narrative. So I'm a big fan of Amazon's backwards law. Amazon envisions already a successful feature and writes the first press release of that feature. This is the prompt I have been using. Next, we want to build a strong product strategy. I'm a big fan of Gibson Biddle's DHM framework. In its essence, it's about crafting a product strategy that delights users hard to copy and margin enhancing ways. So we use Gibson Biddle's framework in order to craft a strategic proposal. Next, we want to create a roadmap. So here, we want to get inspired by competitors. What I added to the prompt is that based on our primary competitor, we want ChatGPT to come up with a sample roadmap using the now, next, later method. Here are the results. Section three, ideation and validation. So now that we have a strong vision narrative, we want to now dive deeper into what features we should be building. What ChatGPT can do is to generate feature ideas, but I also added to the prompt that these features should make us money in the next two years. Next. We want to understand the user's needs and problems in greater depth. We can assume ChatGPT to be a user of our product, how the day in the life of that user is and what problems the user is facing. Lastly, based on the insights gathered above, what features do our customers want the most? Now that we have a feature list, we want to prioritize them. So here I want to leverage ChatGPT to prioritize features based on the Kano model. Here are the results. And then a layer deeper, we can also ask ChatGPT to use a weighted value model, where ChatGPT makes a weighted approach on the variables strategic relevance and individual impact of the feature. Here we can insert features we want to build and have ChatGPT prioritize them first. Next up is quality assurance. So here two prompts stand out for me. First, high level, what would be some features of the products we should be testing? And secondly, write out all the test cases for the user's heavy path. So this gives us a checklist of the parts of the product we should be consider testing. Next, now that our product is tested well and working as expected, we want to go to market. Here, a very useful prompt is to let JGPT assume being the CEO of our company, outline go to market plan to get to our first 100 paying customers. Next, you can also write feature announcements. We don't take ourselves too serious. So you can pinch a bit of humor into this. So this is the prompt I've been using. And then lastly, now that we launch our product, we want to get feedback in order to further improve our product. So here we can ask ChatGPT, what are the most common complaints about my product? Here we already get a high level insight on what we can improve on. Secondly, a bit more granular. If you gathered some app reviews or some emails of customers, then we can copy paste them into ChatGPT and have it create a crisp summary of that feedback. I hope you liked that video. And don't forget to grab a free copy of the Notion database with over 100 ChatGPT prompts that you can leverage as a product manager. Smash that subscribe button, give a thumbs up, I heard it's good for the algorithm. And also I'm very curious to understand 
What are your favorite prompts you have been using as a product manager and write it down in the comment section below. See you next time.